What is up, everybody? Episode number 11, coming at you. Of Pine, Episode 11 of Pine. Uh, in the last episode, we explored more of the world and we came across we did more of our quests um and a, we came across a outpost one of the what was it one of the oh, ancient city one of the ancient sites and discovered uh animal farming uh animal taming more so uh, we we're in this house. We had two. The ancient. Okay, ancient stables is what this one is specifically called. They're called vaults. That's what it was. Um, we explored these vaults and we learned about taming animals. Um, we learned. Oh, oh, oh goodness. Part of me. Every time I turn this game on, it just yawn. Um, so we learned. Hold on, let me see. Is this written down anywhere? Um, mm -hmm. um, trying to figure out how these are. This is locations. Duh. Uh, looks like we've. Uh, We've try, I'm trying to remember how we tame them. That's the question. Um, they're called species. Okay. Um, okay. Um, I guess we'll just have to go back in here and reread the journal. Uh, Wild Tooth is a strange brand of creatures, part canine, part aquatic. Their most valuable skill is the impeccable sense of smell. They can find resources deep underground. Only problem is that they often put them there in the first place. But at least they retrieve them. Um, there was something else. Oh, exploring the ancient stable. Oopsie. Okay, sorry. Um, goals. Um... Explore the ancient stables. There was something that we had to make because we had the mammoth callus crafting. Oh, the attic key. We need uh, our Donna wing, Lomaconda tooth, Lomaconda tooth. Oh my goodness, that was tough to get out of my mouth. Um, but upstairs, we learned that the what was it? The Um, no, I don't want to push that book in. I'm trying to read books. No, nothing. Okay. Um, turn on all these torches here. Um, we read that the, um, not these guys. Those are the elephants. Um, Oh, this is the secret to figuring out how to get the uh, Lamanda. The I mean, not the Lamanda. The Mammoth Callus. Uh, what's this? Puffles. The attraction makes everyone favorite. They're harmless, a bit useless. Uh, bouncy spine. Yes, jump pads. That's how we were going to get to that one place. Um. So, uh. Oopsie. Sorry. Sorry, I'm not going to miss of antennas. Hold many mysteries and powers. Yes, the bleaker is hard to tame, even though humans seem to do it more effortlessly with their hands. Gain their loyalty, and you can gain a very powerful ally in combat. Um, oh, that's what we needed the key for. Um, oh, we already have this. Um, what is this? Oh, yes. Uh, Lumaconda, the supposedly enormous uh, anguin creature explorer in the night, but it did sink its teeth into some of the trees on our grounds, so we are now conducting experiments in the library. The goal is to find out what their teeth can get through, or rather what they cannot get through. 
So far, some of the hardest materials have not chipped anything off. Okay, so it seems like the tooth is going to be in one of the trees. Um, we have might have found the hardest material on the island, albeit not the most hygienic. Yes, mammoth callus have proven mammoth callus have proven to be almost indestructible. We have been trying to chip parts off to using crafting in the back of the stables between the bleaker and the waddle craft. Its strange quali qualities seem to require that it is hidden. Oh, this is the um, how we got the mammoth callus. That one was. Um, is this? Oh, the wings of the legendary Ardana bird. Such qualities we have seen rarely in any object. Lucky for the, uh, they seem to leave feathers behind in trees near water. Okay, so we need to go and um, find a tree near water. We also need to find the tree that might have a tooth in it. So we gotta check all the teeth around, all the trees around here. See if there's any teeth sticking out of them. Because they said that the bleaker, or not the bleaker, the uh, Lumaconda sunk its teeth into one of these. Okay, and we also have to get these guys into here, but first we need to be able to tame them to move them, I believe. I believe that's what we were told. Oh, oh man. Yawning fit. Oh. Um, just keep looking. Nothing on that tree. Anything on this one? Nope. Uh, this tree. I hope we don't just keep going. I hope we don't end up going in circles and I look at the same tree multiple times. Nothing on that tree. Oh, a feather. Um, well, speaking of feathers, can we... Aha! Look at me, I am smart. Ardana wing. I need two of those, though. Did I grab two? Uh, it's a quest item, I guess. Uh, I only have one. Okay. So I should probably be looking up in the trees as well. Oh, this is probably... I know I probably said this last time, but this is probably where we can dig for the uh, thing. The dig with the animal, the animal that digs. Uh, there's a bleaker, we don't want to mess with him just yet. Uh, nothing in that tree. I think that this tree has already been explored, yeah. Um, did we explore any of the central trees? I don't think we did. Nothing in that guy. We definitely explored that guy. What about this guy? Nothing. Usually, as you can see, they have um, like that white triangle or white um, diamond shape uh, in front of it to say that you can interact with it. Um, okay. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any... Uh, our daughter feathers. Oh my goodness. Work wasn't that crazy. Um, <laughs> um, no Ardana. Oh, there's an Ardana feather. Okay. That makes me believe that if I can find all of these objects in here, that why wouldn't I be able to find that tooth? that we need, because we need the tooth for, the Lumaconda tooth for that. It doesn't make sense that it wouldn't be in here, especially since it says it's on the, on the grounds. And we can go up top and see if it gives us any other hints, but I'm pretty sure that there was no hint. Other than it's in a tree on this. That's where we got the man Manoth Callus. Uh, let's 
let's go inside here and double check what this has to say. Oh. oh, there we go. Okay. Um, was it this guy? Uh, Lumaconda, the supposedly enormous anguin creature, exploring the night, but it did sink so its teeth into some of the trees on our grounds. So now we are conducting experiments in the library. The goal is to find out what their teeth can go through or what they cannot get through. Oh, okay. So I assume that this, where is it? The experiment, is it upstairs? Am I just crazy? No, it's in here. This experiment is to figure out where, oh. Duh, okay. Well, that was not, I did not see that before. Okay, put that down, yes. Uh, I think I might have glitched that out. Okay, now we pull this and we should get something. There we go. We got the Manoth Callus back and the tooth. Okay, so that was obviously meant to be. Um, well, let's put that down. Let's grab a Lumicon tooth and a Manoth Callus. Okay, then we can construct the key, and that will get us, where are we going, over here, no, it was, we needed to go out a window, onto a deck, here, and then we can go up here, hit this, go up, and then here we enter this area and then we have to use the attic key to get into these stairs which take us oh cutscene i haven't had a cutscene in a long while looks like these panel illustrates the history the tambas have always been great with critters it seems and with humans too they're teaching them Riding Al Alpha Fence. I wonder what else could we, they could do with critters. Huh. Oh man, what is that? Yeah, what is this? That looks very ominous. What the heck? I found the taming bands. Okay, cool. Use R, use R to use it on critters to influence their behavior and let them follow you around. By default, they will follow you, but you can press R to make them wait too. Holding R will make you whistle, which brings your critter closer to you. Okay. Well, that is quite ominous. Um, how do I, can I take a screenshot? Um, I need to figure out how to do that. Um, hopefully that if I stay here long enough, the, uh, oh, actually I can, I can take a photo out from it. Um, what's this? Uh, after a prolonged introductory phase, we arrived at the practical part of training the humans in the laws of biology. We were surprised by their ability to adapt and overcome. The taming bands they created are not only a creative, but also very effective solution for taming the critters. Our studies have extended to the humans and their use of the critters. We cannot wait to see if they pertain the same predominance that we Tambas have by using the tool. Um, is there any other secrets up here? Um, I'm not seeing anything. That's pretty cool. What does Alt do? Nothing. Okay, well it says that it's supposed to do something. Nope, press both, nothing happens. Okay. 
Well, that was nice that they didn't had any like crazy lore stuff up there. Um. Aha. Uh -huh. Follow me, sir. We will put you in your pen. Hold R to untame. Um, hold, oh, that's not R. <laughs> there we go. Okay, we have one. Uh, we need the walrus and a bleaker. But to get to the walrus, I think that we need, oh, also if we, oh, and if we do the, okay, cool. We got a lot of things we can do. I can't even put it into words right now. Um, what is this? Oh, the only way is to tame the Puffle. Okay, it's like a chain of events. Got it. Alrighty. Come on over here, buddy. And R to stay. Right, R. Aha! Look at that. Sweet! Making progress. Let's go. Honestly, I'm going to be honest. I think that we are <laughs> still in a tutorial phase. Or the way that they're introducing this is really awesome. Um, oh, we can mount this thing. Awesome. Oh, and it's fast. Okay, this definitely... We definitely have to complete this race. Uh, let's unmount. Let's interact with this. And let's get on our mount. And let's finish this race in record time. Um, oh, it says help West with the critters to get out of the ancient stables. So I was never able to leave anyway. Okay. That definitely had just gotten updated. That was not like that earlier. Oh man, gonna be cutting it close. Oh no. Winner. Oh, and that unlocks the bleaker. Oh, well, they definitely like to, um, enter, they are definitely, this is good introduction. It's good puzzling because obviously we needed the, um, we needed each creature to unlock each different critter. Okay, sorry. <laughs> um, which is nice, a great introductory way. Um, shows you what each thing, what each creature can do when tamed. Um, the puffle is there. Okay, next we're on to the bleaker. Um, R to tame. There we go. Why won't you? Oh, why won't you tame? R. There we go. Okay, come on, buddy. Then, how do we, how do we get him to, interesting. I don't know what I did there. Um, R to tame you. Um, and E to dig. No, alt. No, do you not dig? You might not be the digger guy. Okay. Um, let's go back and tame this guy. Oh, okay. Okay, you're tamed. Yep. That hurt a lot. Um, let's see. Let's get the eggplants. Eat one. There's only one bleaker, so we don't want to obviously slay it. Um, there he is. Um, let's put him in his pen. Come on, buddy. There we go. Um, it doesn't seem like I have to untame a creature or critter, they call them, um, to tame another one. So we can just get this walrus guy here. Um, R to tame, and then can we get this guy to dig? Oh, he did. 
Cool. So if you just hold E over here, you just press E, he'll dig. No? Will he not dig? Dig, dig, dig. Dig. No? Why won't you dig? What, did I discover a crouch button? <gasps> There's a crouch button? Well, that was an explained <laughs> tutorial. Well, that's embarrassing. <laughs> I told you I was coming in blind. I have no, no idea what the heck is going on. Um, yeah. We got this all done. That's awesome. Well, so let's see what's next. Wes obviously has something to say to us. What do we got here? Wondrous! All back in their pens. Uh, the others shall be delighted as I am. Any luck on your side? Yes, yes, I managed to open the doors just fine. I'll be taking the next year or so to figure out what we can do next. Let's stay in touch. Next year? Does that mean that there are seasons? Oh, help Wes out with the critters. I did. No. Um, this is unprecedented. Whoa. What did just I, what? Oh, uh, well, there's a free travel kit and interact with something. This was not here before. To all leaders of Albemarle, rumors that a human is back on the island seem to be true, and it is sniffing around the vaults. We need to take extra measures in making sure they remain unscathed and history does not repeat itself. We are arranging a meeting with the Tombas to secure a proper locking mechanism. You found a travel kit which allows you quickly travel to important locations such as the house of the Tombas, but also the villages of neutral or allied species. You can do that. You can do that by opening your map and selecting a village and place of choice. New island state. The species on the island reacted to you ex exiting the vault with an out with an out finding. This affects how hard it is to maintain friendly and neutral relationships with the species on Albemarle. Prodigy's progress. Um, how am I supposed to get out? Just climb? Is this what I'm supposed to do? Did they wall me in on purpose? I am confused. Talk to Gre G Jerry and Marla. Uh, well, where on the map is that? Uh, I think that's at home. Um, yeah, that is home. Uh, well, on that note, it was a great episode. Completed a big chunk of uh, storyline there, learning how to tame all the animals. Um, got a little bit more of the world is reacting to what we have done at learning to tame the world. It doesn't seem like the humans were the good guys in the, in the past. Um, so we will explore more of that storyline and next episode. If you like the episode, hit that like button. If you want to get notified for the next episode, when the next episode comes out, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to get notified when the next episode comes out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.